Okay, in this question they say that there are 27 students in Miss Austin's class. What she does is groups her class into three teams that have an equal number of students. How many students are on each team? So when they say they divide these teams into equal numbers, that means there are the same number of people on every team. So if you start with 27, right? and you want to you wanna split them in three groups, what you can do is think, okay, if I have 27 and I divide it by three, how much does each person actually get? So that's really what this problem is about. You have 27 and split them into one group, right? A group, two groups, another group, and three groups. So, well... How will you do this? Well, 27 divided by 3 is what? Well, I know that, that, that 3 times 10 is 30. So 27, well, that's 3 less than 30. So instead of doing 3 times 10 is 30, I would think 3 times 9 is 27. And what this means is that each group here will have 9 people in it. So altogether, you have 9, 18, 27 people and all the groups are equal in the class right and they can all work together so so when they say how many students are on each team they say that because they don't want you just to add up all the students we know there are 27 students here um, but the number of students on each team is right here there should be nine students on each team and I would pick D for my answer all right thanks a lot